Caretaker's ally, Harmesis 1, and the Buried Treasures 1, guys. Should we just take Caretaker's ally like a freaking idiot? Huh. Aw, oh, man. The branching out like a freaking idiot? That's more fun. Boom. Um... So again, the current patch is really awful, I just want to say that. So we'll see how we do while doing something like this. We are on Skull Puddle though, so that's great. Branching out, huh? Branching out. Okay, so we need to hold Nars and Kindreds, guys. That is the number one rule of this current patch. You have to hold them. Uh, they are beyond broken. You have to grief the people that are going to play them. You must grief them. It is unplayable otherwise because they will just win the game for free. That's just part of the game right now. The patch is basically only Kai'Sa is viable, uh, Nar, Kindred, and nothing else. The only other thing that is kind of viable is Lee Sin, uh, Kane, and Morgana carry with um, Heavenly and Sage, right? It's the only other thing that is like kind of okay, and every other comp is just really, really meh. So uh, we'll see what we'll do. We'll see what we'll do. Let's see what the augment we get, right? Or what thing we get. Warden emblem. <laughs> Do we reforge this? Do we reforge that? I feel like we reforge it, no? Frig it. I'll take this. I'll take this. Uh, we just go um, Arcanist the Mumu, right? Nice. I can play. See, this is good. This is good. This is the only way you can have fun on this patch is if you get lucky and you somehow get something that allows you to play like a weird comp, right? A weird comp that no one's gonna play. You today. A weird comp that no one's gonna play, right? But it can be good, right? I, I am not joking about this. I will not sell them the entire game. It's worth giving up some money just to not have a 3-star NAR in the game because that 3-star NAR will win the game no matter what, unless a Kai'Sa player is level 10 with 2-star Kai'Sa, 2-star Zaya, perfect items. You will lose, but yeah. Uh, who else is Arcanist? These are 6 Arcanists, and who else? Oh yeah, Syndra, Syndra. Okay, so we go uh, Zoe reroll and uh, Amumu reroll, right? Zoe, Amumu reroll. Zoe, Amumu, 3-star, no one's gonna buy these units. Again, this is like a really off-meta comp, but if you have a, if you get 8 Arcanists, you can do fine, right? I'm sure you can do fine with it. And Arcanist Amumu especially is very tanky. So I'm sure we'll be able to do okay with it, hopefully. Perfect, already have 2 Zoes, extremely good, guys. 2 Zoes already, extremely good. And then, um, yeah, we just go 3-star Amumu. Amumu is super important. Amumu is the most important unit of this comp. With Arcanist, uh, he's gonna heal so much, and it's it's really strong. Like, it's the best asset of this comp. Arcanist Amumu is so busted. It's actually, it's actually like, low-key low OP. Low-key a little bit OP. Okay, we need a Lux for 4 Arcanist. Right now, or an eco, they are the most accessible, they're the two costs. Alright, let's go! Hopefully we win this fight, otherwise I'll sell one of these guys. Yeah, I mean, Kindred Nar will be giga contested. <laughs> Classic, so... I don't want to sell them, I hope I win this fight, I think I will. Remember, Yone got nerfed, and Volley Bear, everything got nerfed, so like... Yeah, it's just, like, nothing is viable. <laughs> It is what it is, but they, they I think they said they will hotfix, so hopefully for tomorrow I don't have to play um, yeah, on this patch anymore. 
please. By the time I upload these videos, they, it will already be hotfix, maybe. Hopefully. A big win. Let's go. 40 gold. Nice. We're not even losing early game. That hard. And we have a duplicator. Wow. And meow. Sorry. I'm kind of down to level. Like, I'm actually down to level. Why wouldn't I level? Like, what the frick? Why would I? Why wouldn't I level, right? Holy frick, guys! We have a two-star girl, man. That's crazy. What was the heavenly comp, brother, man? The heavenly comp. What was all the heavenlies except for uh, Soraka? And then you just play Lee Sin. Kane, Morgana, and at level 9, Diana. If you find Wukong at level 8. If you don't find Wukong at level 8, you play Diana at level 8. Level 9, Wukong, yeah. And enjoy, sir. It's really cool. It's gonna be one of the best comps after the hot fix. And it's gonna be a cool comp. It's gonna be fun to play, for sure. Actually, pretty nice. I can have 6 Arcanists already. Game over, guys. Deserve. I can have six Arcanists already next turn. I'll just level. We're on Skull Puddle, not Crab Rave. Skull Puddle. Uh, we hope we get the Lissandra, right? Level 9, Lissandra. And then we just have insane. Um, yeah, Lissandra is insane, right? To farm items. I think we should really re reroll. Nice. Dragon Claw is not bad. Spirit. Okay, I mean, it's just Dragon Claw and Gargoyles, or what? Not really, though. I kind of want this Ionic Spar. Choice. I'm still making 50. I kind of want Ionic Spark, no? I could go Static Shiv later. Alright, let's go! <clears throat> Remember, I always talked about Static Shift being good on Zoe, right? I was completely wrong, guys. Throw that out of your brain. I was dumb as frick. It is not good on her. She needs kills to increase the number of ricochets of her ult. Assists do not count. I always kept yapping about how assists are good. It is not. It is trash. I think I just have to go Dragon Claw here. Keep the temple. Assists do nothing. Static Shiv is still gonna be good, just on somebody else. We want Zoe to be our juicy carry. She's gonna have Jewel Gauntlet. Um, whatever, right? Giant Slayer, whatever. Needs to do as much damage as possible. What frick are those, man? You think this is good? Not really, right? Item Grab Bank? I'll just take this, then. I'll just take this, it's fine. It gives me frontline. And 3-star uh, Ilawi as well, right? 3-star Ilawi, 3-star Amumu, 3-star Zoe. And then uh, level 9 to find Lissandra. 9, uh, uh, 8 Arcanist. Game over. We win the game. 4 free. 125 AP for everybody. For all my units. Not bad. Good stuff. 3 stars Zoe since no one plays those units. Exactly. No one's playing this trash. You can only play it if you have an Arcanist emblem. And if you high roll, and I am high rolling, I have a small duplicator. I'm good to go, man. I'm still gonna lose to Nar 3, Kindred 3, if they hit 3 stars. I will still lose. I promise you. I will not win the game if there is a Nar and Kindred 3. It is really stupidly OP. And Kai'Sa will also obliterate me, probably. So we're looking at a third or a second this game. But that's great, right? That's honestly great. It's as much as you can expect from this patch. Will he grants you a support item which lasts three rounds? Sure. I mean, this is pretty good with Unified, though. Nice, Amu is here. Amu is already better than this trash. Amumu is better than a trash guy. No cap. 
I could level here. I have so much money. Just play a second Lux, right? You're just gonna freaking send the thing into the back line. And kill everything. Nice, there we have uh, uh, a Kindred and Nar player. And I'm holding them the entire game. And I hope I'll find more. I will not get let go of them. Dragon Claw is not that good in this meta. It's mainly Nar and... Um, and Kai'Sa, right? But it is what it is. Nice, beautiful double, double stuns by the... By the freaking um, Luxus. Amazing. Let's go. I feel like they should add something cool to 8 Arcanist. Usually they have something like... You know, something utility style. They should add something cool to 8 Arcanist. I feel like 8 Arcanist is just... Just so much AP, but it's a little bit underwhelming. In my opinion. I think I'm going Jewel Gauntlet, right? Jewel Gauntlet is super important. We want those crits. What's Biss build on a Mumu? I don't know. I assume... I, I, I would even say double arc... Uh, double... Double... Double Biss thing, right? Gargoyles? Nice, I can hold the Kai'Sa. Like a boss, guys. Like a freaking boss, man. Surely I'll get a Jewel Gauntlet, right? I can hold Kai'Sa like a Babus, guys. Beautiful! I'm gonna hold her the entire game. This guy's playing a two-star Zoe, not sure what the frick he's doing. He found Alessandra, not sure what the frick he's doing. Great. He's rolling down on seven, not sure what he's doing. I do not understand. I do not understand. I would be more surprised that he's not stream sniping than that he is stream sniping. Like seriously, it's actually crazy. Actually crazy that he... Like that, that team looks like he's not gonna go anywhere because he's rolling, I think, for it. I don't know. Weird. I don't know, we'll see. But we're, we're winning. We're in a really good spot. Hopefully we can win the next fight as well so we can go with the full win streak into Wolves. Let's see what this is. Alun offers you a choice of complete items, sure. Give me a Jewel Gauntlet. Ionic Spark. I mean, we take those, right? Oh, there was a Nasher's Tooth, though. Maybe I should have taken Nasher's Tooth. What do you think? I feel like Ionic Spark is more impact. I think I'm gonna give up on this. I'm gonna hold the Gnar instead. That's a lot of moves. I'm gonna do this because this still hits them. And he's in the middle now. Or she's in the middle now. I was rolling for two-star uh, Ilawi, so I have a two-star Ilawi that stays alive. And, uh, you know, the Ionic Spark stays alive. No, Nashers is one of the best items on Zoe. Jewel Gauntlet Nashers. The Shoujin is the best build, I think. With this setup, with eight Arcanists. Because you really have plenty of AP. Alright. Bada bing, bada boom. Please win this, come on. He's bouncing it. I mean, we win this easily. The Amumu, you can see the Amumu just doesn't die. Oh, that is really bad. I think we lose. So cringe, bro. So cringe, I'm gonna sell one. Ah, it's just unlucky. Not much we can do. I'm just very unlucky. Ah, she got targeted by the one star freaking Alun. It is what it is. Just unlucky, man. My Zoe was uh, not doing well that fight. She, you, you saw her when she killed the Yone, that was her first kill she got. So she only had one bounce. It was really unfortunate. The Zoe dropped the ball that fight. Zoe is uh, really bad at two star. That's the problem with Zoe. That's why you don't see it often. She's really bad at two star and gets only good at three star. I mean, I have the thing. Watch this. I can go Infinity Edge, worst case. 
This is my choice. Your decision is made. Take it if you can. Just hold all the Kai's us, I'm not even kidding. This game is trash. I could go Infinity Edge, man. I might have to, no? I could go Giant Slayer Hodge. Eh, uh, Thieves Law. I, I don't mind Giant Slayer Thieves Law. She won't have that much crit chance. Yeah, I don't mind Giant Slayer Thieves Law. I think I'll do that. Depends on what I get on the next carousel. I think I'll just wait. Nah, no, Thieves Law is kind of nice though, right now. Thieves Law on Nico for more frontline is pretty nice, right? Why two Luxes? Because I have nothing else to play right now. A Ruid Grab Bag is really good. I think I like I, I don't think this is worth. Like Mana Zane isn't even that good. It'll be on Syndra, it's not even that good. And then uh just tank item. I, I feel like this is so good. Because this allows me to just aggressively roll down now. Syndra is not important. Syndra is not important, frick this unit. For some reason, I'm not finding a Zoe spam. I could already 3 star a Mumu and just go level 9. Uh, maybe that's the right play, actually. I'm so far... No, I think 3-starring everything is the best. With 3 duplicators, we can easily do that. Just roll until we... Yeah, because... Yeah, yeah, yeah. 3-star everything, I think this is the best play. Like, 6... Um, 6 Arcanist with 3-star everything is better than... I 8 Arcanist with uh, only 3-star move, I think. That lasts until used. I'll use them right away. I got nothing out of them. That's kind of cringe, bro. <clears throat> Is he actually trying to 3-star Zoe? That's just so cringe. Oh. I mean, there's nothing I can do, right? If someone is stupid, there's nothing we can do, guys. Wait, people have no meta read. I thought people would know what to do in this meta. They have no clue what the meta is. The only guy that knows is this guy. And I was the only one guy griefing him and holding his units. No one knows. Like, this is so trash. This, this guy will go dead last, man. Like, he's gonna beat me here, right? Obviously, because he has a 3-star and I don't. But, like, he's gonna go dead last. Okay, we need to roll before he dies. Because he's taking so many 3 costs. That are not the ones that I need. If he loses to me here, that would be so embarrassing, right? That is just embarrassing, guys. That is just embarrassing, man. Do you understand how much they over-nerfed Bully Bear? That is embarrassing, guys. Straight up. Straight up embarrassing. Do you see this? That's crazy, guys. That's actually disgusting. Oh, I can get my item here, please. It's looking good. No. Never mind. Maybe I can still get it. Nice. Oh yeah, I got my Giant Slayer. Okay, nice. I could 3-star Zoe right now. I have to get rid of her out of the team planner. And honestly, Nico as well, man. Nico is not gonna happen. Oh, nice. This is my choice. Okay, I mean, I'm just chilling. <laughs> I'm just gonna chill, bro. Oh, frick. Oh, 
Okay, this guy's three star. Um, Yone, again, this got nerfed as well. It is probably still okay, though, if he has it this early. I would say this is a huge high roll that he has it this early. Without the economy augments, right? Giga high roll, bro. Giga high roll. Ah, not, not enough damage, right? Not enough damage to kill him. Need need uh, need the Lawi three and a Mumu three still, honestly. Also, I should play double a Mumu, I think. Nah, actually, a Mumu is not a sorcerer, not an Arcanist. Oh wow, that's crazy items. Freak, that's crazy items, man. I mean, actually, a Mumu is still frontline, right? Might as well. So E three wins that, yeah, for sure. Okay, I mean, this guy's just gonna win the game, probably. Yeah, probably. Good enough augments. This, this, uh, I'm gonna lose this. I'm gonna lose this. I mean, maybe we can just one-shot this with Lux, if we get lucky. 3-star Amumu wins this, right? Like, 3-star Amumu can, uh, not wins it, but we can maybe win. Because 3-star Amumu is just so tanky. Like, ridiculously tanky, right? can win maybe look how broken Nar is man it's so stupid man like this is just embarrassing by this company honestly guys it's just embarrassing guys this is an embarrassment embarrassing patch embarrassing embarrassing for real okay I mean we gotta roll down I don't know man I kind of want to level though and roll on eight because I can find uh, I can find um, Lissandra on eight, right? Guys, what are the chances on level eight for three uh, three costs? It's thirty six. They nerfed it from forty to thirty six on level seven. How much is it on eight? Is it like thirty four or something? Thirty three. Thirty three is kind of significant. I think I want to stay at this. Then. Because I really just need these three stars, right? Also, what's my what's my next item? Crown Guard, maybe? Actually, is it Crown Guard? Uh, I think it is still Crown Guard. Okay, I, I would really like to have Ilawi 3, right? Instead of just duplicating this, this Zoe now. But I think at this point we have to just duplicate Zoe. Am I really losing this? I mean, this is just side diff. Like, my Amumu was on the left because it, 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 it combined and then it just spawned on the left like a freaking idiot. Like, there's not much I can do about this, man. It's just Amumu is on the left instead of here because it's two Amumus and of course it just spawns on the left and instead of on the, yeah, instead of on the one that has the items. I, I, there's not much you can do about that. Like, what the frick is this, right? I mean, I for sure just level now, no? Am I, am I really just gonna three-star Zoe with this? The, the, the Zoe is contested as well. We still have one more duplicator after. I think I'm just doing it. I think I just play this. I should have leveled here, I think. I mean, there's nothing to level for, right? I need Lissandra. I need to just reach level 9 now. 3 star Amumu, 3 star Zoe, 3 star Lux. Surely we're fine, right? Surely the game is not that imbalanced. Alright, guys. Yeah. Okay, Zoe going crazy. That's good. That's really good. Okay, let's go. Zoe is going crazy, guys. What the frick is this? Whatever, who cares? Just ignore it.
Uh, what am I supposed to play? I could play Ghostly, I guess, right? It's not that bad. Okay, let's see how this goes. Zaya 2? Zaya 2! At stage 5 3. Oh, he has the cash out. He has the um the fortune cash out. Yeah, okay, this guy wins the game, right? Whatever, bro. Fortune cash out, that's pretty cringe. Nothing you can do about that, right? He just wins the game. Uh, so shouldn't we just roll down because he's gonna win the game anyway? I'm playing for a second, so shouldn't I just try to preserve as much health as possible? Yeah, I should. I should try to preserve health now. Only. I should just roll down, which is very sad. Ah, fortune cash out, man. The joy. What the joy, guys. I think I just won frontline, honestly. How many, how many Lowies are out of the pool? Zero. Three. Zero. Still zero. 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 So where are my Lowies, guys? Can someone explain that? It's, uh, three. Oh, this guy has so many for some reason. Okay, just let him die first. Just let him die first. Just let him die first. And then we'll roll down. I guess. The thing is, I do need uh, Elisandra for the peak, for the peak thing, right? No prison can hold. I can play Bruiser. I guess that's worth. Okay, this guy. I mean, I shouldn't lose, right? I shouldn't lose, man. They over nerfed this Holy Bear so hard, man. It's not even close. He has Rabadons on freaking Wukong. They over nerf Holy Bear so hard. Surely we don't lose. Oh, but this, this, uh, this, uh, the Lux has useless items, basically. I think we lose, man. Jesus Christ, bro. Oh. Boy, that was so satisfying. Oh, <laughs> that was so freaking satisfying, man. This is the guy with the Yalawis, right? He died. Nice. Don't I just roll down here, man? Don't get hit. Pretty sure that's just the right play, man. Ah, it's sad, but it's just the right play, right? Like, you can't really do much. Oh, that Yone is gonna kill my Zoe so fast. Ooh, next ult is gonna kill her. After this one. Oh. Might jump here? No, he's gonna jump here. Oh, nice, nice. Lucky. Lucky, honestly. I think she's gonna wipe it now. Nice, good job, huge. If we get a top three, we're happy, right? Like, this, this is just... <laughs> the game is... Ah, <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, this guy's level 10. Uh, cash out, right? Ridiculous, obviously. Then, um... You, you can see his freaking target dummies, right? With Radiant Warmogs, two of them. Radiant Bloodthirster. Then this thing, uh, this thing is just playing the broken comp, right? Obviously broken. And then this guy is, um... Gonna hopefully go fourth, and I go third, and I'm happy. I wish I could go second, but... yeah. Sell this man. Ah, uh, blue buff, nice. Asher's tooth, not bad. 64 to level.
Okay, surely I'm not fighting the big guy again, right? Let's go guys, off cooldown. We fight him as soon as we can fight him again. Very cool, very fun guys. We love this game. <laughs> Nothing you can do about this. Just unlucky. This is probably the difference between third and uh, second. Just fighting him here instead of fighting him later. He's playing Kai'Sa as well, right? He's, it's not like he's playing a comp that is bad or something after the cash out. He's just playing the most broken comp along with Nar, right? So there's nothing we can do. It's just gonna be a third now. A third instead of a second. This guy is avoiding him for five turns. Or this guy is avoiding him for so many turns, right? Extremely cringe, guys. Donkey rolling for the girl. I mean, I have to just donkey roll, right? We try. We tried. Nice, bro. Nice, Lux, man. You're so cool, man. I have to put her in the back line anyway, man. You're so cool, Lux. You're really cool, man. Let's let's keep getting tank items 50 turns in a row, you freaking idiot. This guy is actually really strong, man. I don't know if I'm beating him. He is full Dragon Lord, I think. Yeah, he is. Two-star Rakan. Or is it two-star Rakan? Oh, it's not. I thought it, the least it looked like Rakan for a second there. I right, big shield, big shield. Zoe's gonna go crazy. See, Zoe, they need to do something about her. Like, this is so un inconsistent to get kills, right? Oh, I might actually lose this. Oh, nice. Right, Zoe is pumping. Zoe is pumping. If I fight him, I can maybe win. Okay, I'm fighting him. Am I fighting his ghost or am I fighting the real? I need to get lucky and fight his ghost and he fights this real and I'm second. Surely that's gonna happen, right? Come on now. Like surely we don't just get only unlucky, right? Oh, she got Rabadons. I mean, this doesn't really do much though. Hopefully Nar is on this side and getting focused instantly. Nice, okay. Winnable. He's getting hard stuck on Amumu and focused. Winnable. Winnable, actually winnable. Come on, Zoe, pump him. Burst him down. You know what's so bad, man? He found the Lissandra, which counters my Amumu, right? Nice, I think we kill him. Come on, come on, kill everything, nice. Top two, top two. Let's go, guys, huge. Okay, Lissandra, Lissandra on Carousel, I just win, frick it. Nope. Okay, <clears throat> Lissandra in shop, like a babies. Okay, never Lissandra. It is what it is, guys. <laughs> oh. <laughs> cool. Actually, it is cool. Because at least I get content now. I get content. I get content instead of just dying, right? At least he has a cool 3-star. Let's see what she does. She should probably cover the whole battlefield in, in feathers. See what she does. Ooh, that's sick. Ooh, that's sick. She recalls them as well. Not too bad, guys. We'll take it. I would say that was very good. I would say that's as good. Like, guys, we basically got a second, right? I, I was saying I can only get a second or a third, and I actually got a first, right? Because I killed the 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 enemy that should get a first, right? But we outpositioned him and we managed to win, you know, uh, against him. And of course, this guy. Uh, guys, we don't even need to talk about this, right? Not too bad, guys. Strong comp. As I said, the three stars are more important than eight uh, Arcanist without the three stars. So that is really good. I think that is the decision that carried the game here. Subscribe to the bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the algorithm so I can get some more views. And I'll see you next time.